How do I look? Very nice. Very nice. Hi, Hi friends. friends! Welcome to the Erin and Krista Show. I'm Erin. And I'm Krista. Hello! So it's summertime, folks. Well, not technically, but almost. Almost <laughs> on June 21st. Is this how you was? I mean, hello. We want ice cream. So we're going to talk about products that you should start using once it becomes almost summertime. Oh, yeah, baby. So we are obviously wearing accessories that you would maybe find yourself wearing at the beach. Not only are they adorbs, but they also have a function. <laughs> <laughs> Sunglasses, if they're giant, they cover most of your face, so they that's a good thing. Balls. Protect your peepers. And floppy hats. Because these will protect your head, your face, and the back of your neck, because a lot yes. of people forget about that, and your ears. Any who's bots, what is your first product you'd like to recommend to our treasured viewers to use during the summer months to oh, okay. keep yourself looking fresh and hydrated and not burnt to a crisp? In the summer, Everybody wants to be tan. Everybody. Everybody. But what happens when you get tan a lot is you get skin cancer and die. Oh my god! You're kind of a horrible person am I working with here? Ah, no, but skin cancer is not good. It's real. And it really makes, and also the sun makes you look really old. Like an old leather shoe. In order to look tan but not be in the sun, I like to use oh. which is on my body now. So I have this beautiful glow. I have a lip gloss problem. Please ignore what I'm doing. This is the Tarte Brazilians. The Brazilians. Skin Rejuvenating Maracuja Self Tanner. So all of their things have either the, um, what is maracuja it? The, Amazon, the Amazonian clay or the maracuja oil. So this is maracuja oil. Maracuja is just a fruit. It's a from the fruit of the South loom. America, I believe. So this is also really hydrating. So it comes with this mitt. And you really want to use the mitt so your hands don't get... Um, all crazy. This on the mitt, and then you put it all over your body. Of course, you want to make sure that you not on top of your clothes. Shower, shave, <laughs> exfoliate, and then that you're completely dry before you put this on. And then you um, okay. make sure you're completely dry. Apply this in um, like longer strokes. You'll kind of see it. It's like a darker tint. And then you have to kind of stand around nude for a minute, which is fun. And then Never and don't take a shower for eight hours. So I put it on at nighttime after I get out of the shower. But then do you have to like stand naked in your bedroom? No, you know, I, will just, I don't put it on like my a, foot. Like a scarecrow? I just like sit in my makeup chair like this for a little bit. And then it, it dries pretty quickly. It doesn't have a bad like smell to it like a lot of them do. Yeah. And it's very hydrating to your skin, which is nice. But this one is the higher bar of like pricing. It's not as high as like San Tropez, which is about 50 bucks. This is about 34 I believe, and you can buy this at Alto or Sephora. And they have it on the top now because it's summer. Drugstore option that I like is the Jurgens Natural Glow. Is that what it's called? Yeah. Instant Sun. It's a mousse, so it's got like a little pumpy do. I honestly really only use this on my legs because my legs are whiter than the holy freaking moon. <laughs> and they're like little pegs. Little white pegs that dangle from my circular upper half. <laughs> Like so I just started using this this year because, you know, I might start wearing dresses and then I blind all of America. It doesn't get that much color, but that's okay for me because I'm very, very fair. And I'm using it in light bronze, which is, I think, their lightest color they have. So this is something that it says you apply it like once, basically like once, a, once or twice a week. It says you can apply it once and then if that's not dark enough, apply it the next day. Um, so... But I think like it's supposed to dry in 60 seconds so that you're not like goopy or anything like that. And it's pretty cheap. I don't know how much, but we'll link it down below. Yeah. This is by a company called Soap Bronze, which actually I really, really like their self tanner, but I can never find it for the body. Um, but this is for the face. So I like to, again, put this on at night, like after I do my night nighttime routine, put this on my face. And then when you wake up in the morning, it just takes the edge off of my white ghostly glow. So the Soap Bronze, this is in like the lightest color for the face. Oil free, paraben free, and for all skin tones. That is, that, cause that's gonna be a, like another, a higher end line. Yeah, this is, this is a professional line like that you get at the beauty supply store. I don't know where else you would get this. I think they used we'll to look, have it in Ulta. We'll look about. Time. But they have like, um, this is like, the Tarte's got that same thing, no parabens, um, sodium lauryl sulfates, it's gluten free, it's dermatologist 
tested and it's non-comedogenic so it doesn't get in your pores. And honestly, like these products are great because you shouldn't be going out in the sun unprotected, which we did not talk about that. Um, you should not go in the sun. Don't always, leave your house. Always wear sunscreen, <laughs> even if you feel like it's cloudy out because most right. people get burnt when it's cloudy. Um, my favorite sunscreen, which I don't have any to show you, but I'll still link it down below, is actually called Super Goop. It's a very good brand. It doesn't have any um, oxybenzone or like those things in it that freak people out now. Same with this line, the, it's called Kula. This is like a tiny little one from a birch box thing. So this is a very cool brand. <laughs> Their um, like mantra is go green, not red. <clears throat> so they're all about sunscreen, but by they do it, it's 70% or more organic it is they call it farm to face so it's all very green and earthy and good for your body and your skin and the planet and it's also got the so little... protect your giant pile of skin wait is that a reference to one of our other videos yeah giant pile of skin i mean there's also like spray tanning and stuff but i don't know enough about that right i've never done tan. a spray tan let us i'm not know gonna your... stand in the nude and have somebody spray me with a really good <laughs> let us know your spray tan experiences if they've been good or bad um, I just really only ever put it like on my, uh, like any of these like self tanners, like on my legs and sometimes my arms. Because then I'll use like bronzer on my Yeah, because I don't like, in. well actually I have this all, I have this on my arms, everything, it's everywhere. Because mm -hmm. it's a good one. I'm going to talk about um, prepping the face for your makeup before um, you're going out in the hot summer sun. This is new. Tropic. It's by Stila. It is called the Aqua Glow Perfecting Primer. So it's like got a blue color to it, and it's very like slidey. It's very it's very cooling though. When you put it on, it feels like somebody's. It's always cold. It's really like a weird hmm. phenomenon. Feel this. Oh, it is cold. Yes. Isn't that nice? But it gives you like this really pretty like, radiant It'll glow. Be very like refreshing. Yeah, from underneath, and it um your makeup kind of sticks to it, and then it. <clears throat> it just makes you look very better. Pretty. Well, not better, but comparable to the Stay Flawless. Is that the benefit? The Stay Flawless. Because it's in a stick like that. The too. Stay Flawless is a little bit uh, like waxier. Yeah. You really have to work the Stay Flawless, and this is a lot smoother and kind a lot more moisturizing. The Stay Flawless isn't like this. This one has um, create the perfect canvas for your makeup with this refreshing water based primer stick infused with a cocktail of cooling ingredients to leave the skin silky even tone and visibly refined pores. So it's the Stay Flawless is awesome too. I used that when I was in Arizona underneath. Um, but that is a little bit more like waxy, I guess is the word. So the other option if you don't want to use a stick like this is you can use your setting spray. This is just a mini, the Urban Decay All Nighter. There's also the D Slick, which is really good if you're oily, especially in the summer months. You can put this on before or after you put your makeup on. Um, I like to have this little one just kind of like every so often when Throughout I'm feeling. Throughout the day. Ugh. When I'm feeling. Don't like slidey. use it as like breath spray like she just did to me. No. Like an a-hole. No. Remember that time you sprayed me right now? You're fine. Oh my redness! <laughs> you lived. You just got a little fix plus your eye hole. You're great. <laughs> so this is good for that to get your makeup to stay onto your body. Cause it's flipping hot out and it's humid, <laughs> like a swamp, like a swampy swamperton. <laughs> this product is the Airbrush Legs by Sally Hansen. Um, you can pick this up at the drugstore. I like this for the summertime because that's when you start wearing skirts and dresses, and sometimes your legs are pasty pale like mine, and maybe you don't want to use a self tanner. Or also, if you're a woman of elderly age status, like me, and you have maybe some veins and some like <laughs> unmentionables <laughs> on your freaking limbs. Um, what this, other unmentionables would be on your I don't limbs? know, like friggin' spiders and ants, I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> this is veins and shit. Freckles. When you're old, yeah, scars. freckles, scars. This is like foundation for your limbs. So you slap this on and you look like you're wearing some nice pair of pantos. <laughs> or your legs just look really nice and flawless. So when you're wearing it is a dress, good one. you don't scare everyone on the earth. Here, let's do a swatch of it. Yeah, so let's look at it on my this thing. It has a very good coverage. It gets powdery when it dries too. Does it? Like yeah. a velvety? Yeah. Cause on my hands, because I'm really fair, you can see like my veins usually. And it it covers it. Mm-hmm. So I'm excited because I'm on stage a lot to put this on my legs so I don't frighten the children of America. Why are you making that face? Because you didn't say what you do on stage. 
I perform calisthenics on <laughs> a stage filled with cats and ballerinas in a bowl of jello covered in Sally Hands and airbrush legs. <laughs> a tinted moisturizer today because it's a nice way to have a little bit of coverage but not so much that it falls off your face and this is actually so light that it doesn't crease this is where I have the worst so I like to use a tinted moisturizer in the summertime if I want a sheer coverage this is the eminence uh, caramel latte that's just the name of the color tinted moisturizer and it has a broad spectrum SPF 25 I have it on today it's just a nice I actually really like that product, but I like the vanilla latte for my flesh tone. Yeah, because you're a lot more fair than but I am. But it's very creamy and very, like, feels really nice on your skin. It does. It feels very cooling, and then you can still see through. It's very good, though. I use a very little bit. You only need a little bit, but it's funny because I have, I have freckles, and my fiancé kept telling me that there was something on my face. And that was your face. It was my freckles. They're very super organic, though. You can, like, eat their products. Like, ridiculous. Like, they're first ingredient in their papaya body wash is papayas. Not water, not yeah. glycerin, it's papaya. It's very weird, but awesome at the same time. Um, and this is non-clogging, so it's uh, non-comedogenic. Some are hair care products from um, Aveda. They have a whole sun care line. So we'll just kind of go in order of what you might do. I'm gonna start with the spray. Yeah. So they have the protective hair veil, which is just a spray that you can use on damp hair and dry hair, and basically just filters the UV so that it's not like effing up your hair and your color and your skull ruining your skull. Let's give it a little spray. Because when you have a burnt skull no, and a burnt, it peels. A burnt skull hurts really bad. I get that because I have fine hair so my part line gets burned. So you can spray something like this and it you helps need protect it. everything. Yeah, so this is the protective hair veil by Aveda. And then they also have a hair and body cleanser which removes chlorine and salt plus product buildup. So this is something you would use like after you get out of the ocean or the pool to like clean your hair and your body so you don't have like salt or chlorine all over you. And then you follow up with the After Sun Hair Mask which restores and helps repair sun exposed hair. So if you've been swimming all day in the chlorine and the sun and the salt water, salt is very drying. So you would use this to kind of moisturize and repair your hair. So that's all the Aveda Sutton Care line. So, so this is that something worked. that yeah you could put in before because that's what, what it's going to do is like fill the cuticle of your hair. So by filling it with something else, you're blocking it so that like chlorine can't go in there or salt or whatever. You can also use any kind of like leave-in conditioner to do that too. Spray it in your hair before you go in the pool, or put your hair up. Don't dunk your weird head under the water, or wear a bathing cap. Um, I have a few more things. Number one is these should always be in your pocket or your purse or your billfold or your clutch or your handbag or your bra. Right there. See, look, no. now you don't even know I have it, do you? Look at that. I can see it. No, no. Look at now you can't. <laughs> no anyway. One's, no one's going in that deep. So these are um, blotting papers. This, These are by NYX. <laughs> these are by NYX. These are just the basic mattifying. They're almost like a little rice paper. I want to eat that for some reason. <laughs> you just do one of these two to get any of the oil or the sweat. See, this is sticking to my face right now. Because you're so dewy. Because I'm so dewy today. But it just pulls up all of those things without messing up your makeup. Because I always tell all of my clients, pat, don't wipe. Pat your weave. Pat your weave. Because you don't want to um, wipe your makeup off, basically. Because friction will F up your face. So as you can see, a little bit of that yeah. oil, but I think you're that's a, mostly makeup. You're a little greasy little piggy. <laughs> <laughs> that's all this dewy. That's your product. Because I have a lot of, like I have the Benetint on and the high beam and all that. that. And then, um, so these are great. And then the other thing I have is my option for lipstick in the summertime. I like to wear a bold lip typically, but sometimes I don't want to reapply a thousand times or my, you know, if it's hot. Especially if you're like out side doing something like or like that. you're an outside concert and you're drinking yeah. but you still want something so this is the uh josie moran coconut watercolor lip stain plus shine this is what i have on right now this is uh called poppy paradise so one side of it is a lip stain so it's just a really pretty pinky apricot -y lip stain and then the other side of it is like a gloss is a gloss so if you wish you can I put like a gloss that. on, or you don't have to. They have a couple. I think That's there's a great color. I think there's, yeah, four different colors. Oh, no! Your lip gloss fell into a dungeon filled with very hungry warthogs. <laughs> they're going to tear your limbs apart if you go to retreat. 
believe it. Um, <sighs> anyway, so oh. it's the same color family that I have on so my I nails. Just... So this is the, this is called Tropics by Vinyl Look. So in the summertime, it's nice to these really poppy colors are fun to wear. And Vinyl Look stays in your nails for a long time. Like and you a can, week. Yeah, you can buy this at Ulta. This is the Tropics, and then you have to have the top coat. The Vinyl Lux is like the step down of from a shellac or gel manicure. It like cures with like the natural UV light of mm -hmm. the sun. So so usually I can get a week of wear out of Vinyl Lux, and I'm shampooing hair and cutting hair all, mm -hmm. all week, so it's pretty. It's a great product. It's um, really I good like it. it. So the Tropics color, the Vinyl Lux. So I, I think that's it. it. So a uh, bye, friends. Bye, friends. I hope that we can help you with your. Soon to be summer skincare and body care and hair care and butt care routines. And all of the things that you might need to not get cancer. Yes, we want you to protect yourselves and have a fun summer. And keep your face looking fabulous. Yeah, you want to look young. I'm 142 and I look about 23. We talk about summer and we talk about lipstick. We talk about face up and we talk about buttholes. We're very, very crazy and we're generally like lesbians and we like to sit here and record videos for you. God damn it! I swear a lot and I get hit in the face. Oh, don't put your finger in my way. I'll do what I want. These are our summer accessories to keep you looking cute and protect you from the sun. Because the sun is beautiful and makes everybody happy, but it might kill you. It might murder your whole family. Ah! I wear my sunglasses, sunglasses at night. Oh my God. I need and to this is them. not even my hat, but I went to Mexico two, three weeks ago and I can't find my hat. Maybe a shark ate it, maybe a Mexican. Is I don't know. <laughs> no, you look like him. <laughs> God damn it, I hate you. I don't have a green nose. Remember, did that Who knows we're trapped in 